Oh, it's very cold and early. Here we go, 4.15 in the morning. 52 degrees and dark. This is a strange kind of run Disney event, but I'm real excited. This is the cast and family 5k fun run. So I'm waiting for my friends to meet me up. Um, this kind of happened last minute. They had reached out and, and asked if I wanted to uh, join them as their family. So friends over at Track Shack, finally met my friend Maria who's in charge of the ambassador program and got my ambassador singlet. So I got this shirt, singlet, and these are going on to keep me warm because it's still only 50 degrees. Beautiful Christmas tree. Bunch of cast members running. We go out to the parking lot and then we go back in. It's like a reverse marathon. So we go by the lake on the return into the park. All right, first DJ. We're running again, heading back into the park. Things you only see on Run Disney events. The complete backside of Expedition Everest. This is a cool mini mini photo pass looking thing just a little little prop section we're gonna take a little selfie action at look at this all the rivers of light stuff it's a dry dock back here Ooh. Ooh. behind the scenes for sure here we go coming from backstage or back in the park officially i think we stay in the park all the way through the end but we are here and the sun's starting to come up but all the christmas is out we were here the other day with the decorations but it was during the daylight we didn't see the lights on look at that so sad oh it's not changing it changes colors look at doug living his best life we've made it to pandora very gloomy this morning but the sun is trying to come up the other meet and greet we got going on timon oh my i don't know what put a comment down below if you can tell me what this is from but I thought it was the actual Yeti at first, and I almost lost it. That is so cool. Now you can sing Jingle Bells. Yes. We're passing Mount Everest, and the finish line is just past this bridge. Are you ready? Are we going to run at all? Yes, we are going to run. Woo! Very cool. Very fun. You guys did it. All right, so there it is. I got my cast and family 5K fun run medal. My friends left, I had to go run to the washroom. Um, I have five layers on right now, because it's so cold, but I didn't plan on getting those two shirts from Track Shack, but I didn't want to carry them, so I just put them on. So I've got five layers on. It was a lot of fun. I wanted to say thank you to Beth and Chris for saying hi before and after the race. You guys are awesome, and I hope I see you around the parks. It was cool running this and it all being cast members, because I would see some faces that I'd recognize around the parks. Hold on, I'm going to security. Sorry, you can't film in the security area. Um, but it was cool to see, like, I saw one of the DJs from Disney Springs running at one point. I saw some, some security guards that I recognized, some other entertainment people from the parade routes and everything. So that was fun. It was, it was a cool environment. It was even more of a relaxed and fun time than, like, the lower distance run Disney events. But I want to thank you to my friend who invited me out last minute. Uh, it was a lot of fun running with you and the girls. And I think we're gonna do it in the spring because they do a fun run in the spring and fall every year. So I'm hoping that I'll get to join them in the spring. I think last spring it was Epcot. So we'll see where they do it again next year. All right, got my hair done for the wedding. I won't raise it like this. I don't typically do that. Um, maybe I will for the wedding. I don't know. I usually wear it more flat, but my barber Mike likes to do that. And I accidentally got my barber Mike because I looked online this morning and he was booked up through 3 p.m. and I didn't want to wait that long. When I got there at noon, he asked, I asked, like he saw me, just took me like within a minute or two and then got yelled at because he had somebody else booked for that time. So, oops, but thanks Mike for hooking up. And I'm stopping at Publix now to grab just a quick Pepsi for Sarah because she needs it and I want to get her that because she deserves it. Many hours later, Sarah's back working, and she's in the vlog maybe for the first time today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is Sarah, she's my wife. 
She's vlogging or working. Yeah, I'm hoping that I get all the edits done today. And then before we go to Chicago, like I'll get all their additional edits done and then be done with this big project before we go. Booyah. I have my work laptop over there running on automation and I am not doing my three hour run today because of the weird aches and pains I've been having. My right knee was hurting yesterday, hurt this morning, hurt after the 5k. So I rolled out some, I'm gonna foam roll still, but I'm gonna try some yoga because I've been lacking on my running and Sarah and I have been talking about doing daily yoga together. So I'm gonna give, I have two different yogas lined up to give them a try. We may go out later, we may not. We have things to do still and try to be productive on our Sunday. But clearly the Sunday has already wiped this puppy out. Eyes closed chin on the ground. All right, I did an hour of yoga. It was interesting. Did you watch me at all? Yeah, there were some, I did. Like, some goofy moments. Um, we haven't <laughs> been by each other in hours. All day, pretty much. All day. I've been in front of the computer. She's on a high right now because... I finished the catalog. But I will have edits because some of their last edits didn't make sense. So I just kind of like... But the bulk of it. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Like, I sent a front cover to back cover. And I haven't ever done that. Today is super zen. Even though I didn't do my three hour run, but I rolled, I, I rolled, I yogured, I rolled you again. Well on I have to foam roll. I got deodorant today. I got a haircut today. Finished the catalog. Yes. Got good sleep? Question mark? Yeah, and I did my meditation. And did your meditation. I had a Pepsi. protein protein salad from Market on South. Got Pepsi, got Christmas Sprite, and for dinner, we're doing salads. And we got Oreos, so. And Peter got me flowers. And I got you flowers. Yeah, it was, it was a weird Sunday. It felt it's like only it felt 625. Like, a like we still have a whole evening. Yeah. But I don't. Doesn't look like we're going to property. We haven't talked yet. We haven't. Okay. It doesn't look like we're going to a park. Okay. Well, let's eat. Let's eat first, yeah. Alright, that was expectedly unexpected. So that time lapse you just saw, I don't know how Sarah's gonna edit it in. She may just put in like a, a she, me explaining this may be pointless because she could have put a text before that saying our FaceTime with the Air Hearts happened, but we just FaceTime for like two hours almost. Yeah, we were like, we've been planning on doing it all weekend. Um, and so we're so happy. It was, it was late, late enough, the kids were, were asleep so we actually didn't see any Air Heart children, but it was just Ben and Carolyn. Yeah. And it was really good catching up with them. It's always good seeing their faces and hearing their voices yeah. rather than just and talking texting. about their next trip. Just talking about everything. Talking about our next trip because they love our Chicago vlogs. I know yeah. a lot of you guys do, but Carolyn and Ben have been watching our vlogs since before we knew them, back in the Five Five Two Zero Seven, and they loved our like a lot of our Chicago. Mm -hmm. Well, like, Carolyn vlogmas. like grew up in a Chicago suburb, and her grandma. Her grandma lived like around the block from our old apartment. Mm -hmm. um, and so the summer we moved, they actually reached out. They're like, we're in Chicago for the summer. Like, would you guys be wanting to meet up? And we're like, actually, we haven't announced it yet, but we're moving to Florida. That weekend. Yeah, the weekend so, they wanted to meet up in Chicago, we were gonna, we drove yeah. down here. So we just love you guys, them. You guys so know we much. love them. They're the best. Yeah. And it was great to hear their voices <clears throat> and see their Should faces. we just sign off right now? We'll say the sign off now, but then we're gonna edit the message in before this. Okay. All right, today is November 17th, just two simple weeks left in November, then it's December, and right there, next Saturday, Jenna and Bill's wedding. Wait, today's the 17th? Right, right. so today's the 17th. Daily message is from Anna Taylor. Focus on blessing others, not impressing them. Kindness is far more powerful than competition. Thank you, Miss Taylor. Also, so soon, my birthday, less than a month away. 
good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.